Uh, so classmates and friends, today I'm asking you to make a decision that will reflect on all of us for years to come. Uh, it's rare that we have a chance to do something enduring, uh, something truly great, and today is that day. Uh, as you may know, uh, Scotty passed away on Sunday night. Uh, he was nestled in his Carnegie Mellon tartan blanket uh, that the children at the preschool uh, made for him when he first came to campus in, in 1993 uh, with his tail wagging. Uh, perhaps you didn't have the pleasure or the joy of knowing Scotty. Uh, it took me a hospital visit to, to really learn uh, what he was about. Uh, during base camp, I used to give him a biscuit when I arrived on my bike and uh, he was on his morning walk. And when I fell ill, when I had pneumonia in, uh, in Mini One, uh, unexpectedly, uh, his, his walker brought him uh, to my bedside and that became a, a daily uh, activity for, for four days uh, that I was there. Each day he would run in uh, and jump on my bed and he would stay there while the morning, uh, while the morning nurse uh, checked me and, and, uh, and checked my chart. And he would know it was time to go when the nurse hung up my clipboard and, uh, and left. And he would leave his tail wagging. The fourth morning I was feeling particularly sick and uh, the nurse was late with, with her rounds. Uh, Scotty's walker needed to get back here to campus and, uh, and motion to, to pick him up and, and put his leash on. And, uh, and the, little, the little dog uh, puffed up his chest and he refused to move. Um, he, he, uh, he hadn't been given the okay that I was, that I was okay. Uh, so he stayed there like that with his chest puffed up uh, until the nurse came in and, uh, and checked me and hung up the clipboard and, uh, and left. And then he went happily on his way. Uh, I know it's not rational, but it's hard to describe how cared for I felt in that moment. <coughs> uh, if you didn't know Scotty, know that my story is not the only one uh, and that he brought so much joy to everybody on this campus. So Scotty's gone. Uh, we must decide how to remember him. Uh, I ask you, how do we want to be remembered? Gandhi once said that a society is judged by how it treats its animals. And I say that we are judged by how we remember and honor a friend like Scotty. Today, I'm asking you to support a memorial on campus that symbolizes everything Scotty brought into our lives. It's a memorial not only to him, uh, it's a memorial to the values that he represents and represented. Uh, they deserve to be recognized. Help me to honor and remember friendship, loyalty, uh, compassion, uh, steadfast love. Uh, help me honor bringing happiness into someone's life. Please help me honor innocence, which is what Scotty represented. Help me build a sculpture that lets generations to come know that we value these, that we care about these, and that we remember friends who espouse these. Thank you.